quick. Good, good, good. All healthy.
couple minutes. One minute till 10 o'clock. Everybody sleeping in this morning? All right, guys, it's 10 o'clock. I'll give it a couple more minutes, give a couple people the opportunity to jump in. I know I always start behind anyway when I'm doing, when I'm in breaks, I'm always, I always jump in a few minutes later anyway, then I kind of catch up, you know what I mean? I'll give it like uh, about two, three more minutes, and that's it. Everything's paid for, um, so we're ready to go. There's no shenanigans going on today. Ready for that noon. Tribe versus freaking uh, Tampa today. Got Sticks and Glass now. I think uh, well, Tyler, I don't think he's pitched much this year. I don't think so. I don't know. He's been kind of quiet. He's been kind of hurt, right? I know Sticks has been pitching. He got about 190 strikeouts. Something like that. He got a lot of strikeouts. And I think he's pitched around two, close to 200 innings as well. So it's been a good great season for him to try to go load up on some of his I got a lot of his rookie cards I guess I'm gonna get to get some graded but I don't have any of his autos I get some of his autos graded I'm gonna get some of his autos and get him graded <laughs> he's had a great year um what was the other games oh Blake Snell and DeGrom right San Diego New York and the Mets that should be a good one too I'm not even thinking about college football I looked at the lineup today for college football to see if anything caught my eye. Maybe I wanted to catch something. And um, the only thing that kind of did was the LSU game. I think that's like two top 25 teams on that one. But I like UCF because they're right down the road from me. But uh, And they played the other night. And I don't know. Gus, I don't know. I don't know. Gus goes on. I don't know if his, his style. I don't know if he can, he can get the kind of kids to recruit to that school. To fit his style of play in the win. I don't know that his style of play is even like. I don't think I like it as much. I like Scott Frost better. Since he's fired. Scott Frost got fired from Nebraska. Maybe bring him back. I think his style worked with the kind of kids that we got here locally. That you're going to be able to recruit. Versus what Gus is looking to do. I don't know. But then. Gus has been around for a long time. So I'm sure he knows what he's doing. But there's going to be some bumps in the roads. Until he gets some kids in here though. Because right now he doesn't have those kind of horses. I don't think. Go at ten oh four. So two minutes. I'll jump. I'll start it up. I know I'm very punctual. I think I'm ever late for like just about anything. But um, it's early. <laughs> it's not that early. It's ten o'clock, right? It's not that early. Doing the extra blaster box today. I was going to do another giveaway too. Throw something else in there, but I didn't really set anything aside to do it. I'll just catch it on the next video. I'll do something else on the next on the next give on the next one I do. Next one I advertise as being what it is um, on eBay. I put it up last night for the same stuff. And I think that might be my last one because I, if I can't find no more monsters, I'm not going to do a, a blaster. You know, rip only. If I can't find any more monsters, then um, the next one that ends the auctions end on I think Tuesday or Wednesday night. That would be my last one of of the gallery. I think about buying like a case of hobby and a case of jumbo, and then mixing that with some um retail products. 
and doing a bunch of breaks for that because last year I was all in the update, man. And last year I was able to get hobby boxes from one of my distributors too. I got like a half, I get a half a case. I got more than that. I probably got like I got like six to eight hobby boxes, and then I got I think only like two or three jumbo boxes, maybe three jumbos of the topped update. I love that stuff, man. I ripped all of it. <laughs> I didn't sell any of that stuff. I ripped all my hobby boxes of that. And I was loving it. But they were giving me stuff this year. Fanatics came in this year and they cut out whatever distributors I had that did do cards. They cut them. Fanatics got rid of them. They ain't giving them nothing anymore. They only give it to, uh, you know, people that I don't know. <laughs> they don't give it to man, my, some of the distributors I'm dealing with have been around for a long time doing cards. So, long time. For them to cut them out like that. If they bought it, they own it, they have the right to do it. I just didn't like how they they didn't like uh complete the pre orders that were out that were given. Like I was already set to receive stuff and then they the nice came in and spring and sorry, we know you were supposed to get this, but no, you're not getting it now. They should have went ahead and completed that and let that cycle run through and then just not let any more pre orders take place through the distributors. Alright guys, it's ten oh five. I'm gonna start it up. Let's get going. I'll take this, uh, this is the bonus blaster. I'm going to take this set aside. We'll do it at the end. So we'll do the three. So I'd like to see, you know, what we would have got without the bonus blaster in with it, right? Last one we did the same thing, the three blasters and the two monsters. And the last one, the bonus box, we got another auto. So we was able to pull five autos out of this stuff. So hopefully we look at that. First one up. Hot dog. Really? Really? First pack in. <laughs> wow, and it looks good too. Man, I think that's a gem minter, brother. First one out the gate. Foil, rainbow foil, Wander Franco. Ah. Ooh. First one up. Man, what a way to start, right? That kind of like got me, got my juices going a little bit right there, man. I was kind of like, I only got one cup of coffee this morning so far. So I was feeling a little like, a little un, like, uh, I'm already juiced because I'm waiting for that tribe game today. I'm jonesing for that, man, because I would love them to, I, like, I'd, Selfishly, I wouldn't mind. Well, tomorrow I got football. I'll watch them. Unfortunately, I'll be watching the Brownies, but Jackson Coar, rookie. Printer Proof, Sterling Marte, the Mets, Ty Cobb, and Mr. Beebs pitched a hell of a game yesterday. A hell of a game, man. Mr. Beebs won eight and two thirds. Had like how many strikeouts did he have? Like eight strikeouts, eight, nine, ten strikeouts, something like that. Gave up one run, one solo shot, three hits total for the game. The other cat was good too. We got oh I was gonna say we got a red, but no, it's red, but it's not a red red. It's the gold. Modern artist Ronald Cunha, those are really nice. I pulled a, I think I pulled a Bobby Witt for somebody the other day. I think so. It's a Bobby Witt card was all blue. It was, maybe it was the wave, right? They have a wave, a next wave, or something like that. Cunha, modern artist. A 
waterfall, rainbow fall out the gate. Dog. Jose. Got another foil coming up next. Reggie. Reed Devmers. Nice. He started off real hot. Didn't he have like a game where he just absolutely killed it earlier in the year? Like either he had a no-hitter or he almost had a no-hitter or something like that. Remember something along those lines. Turner Proof, Andre Jackson. A couple Kali teams here. Nice rookie parallels. Turner Proof. It's nice too. A little tiny. No, I wouldn't even say it. It's, it's pretty good. Nice redemptive rainbows. So two, both are rainbows out of this blast. You only get two per blaster, and both of them are rookies. You can't beat that, man. I hate when I open of any kind of product and all my parallels are veterans, unless they're like tribe guys. I'm sour, <laughs> you know. Bryce, Buster, got an auto out of a blaster. I have our first blaster box, and it's a green for Kansas City. Jeremy Pena, see on the back. This little corner, it's got a, that little corner right there. It's got a little bit of white on it, just a little bit. Let's see what number this is to. There you go, number twenty-nine out of ninety-nine. So we got an extra auto, but well, we can't say it's extra yet. Those. I've heard reports of people, you know, I didn't want to bring it up in the first video because I didn't want to jinx this, you know what I mean? But I've, there's videos up on YouTube where guys are only, not really pulling their autos out of those monsters, and that would be very, very disappointing. <laughs> got an extra, so we got an extra auto out of each one. That's sweet. All right. KC. Hey, Board with a parallel auto, not the wit that I'm sure you want, but uh, Rodolfo Castro, Marcus Simeon, Jake McCarthy, the printer proof, Rendon, and Shane McClanahan. Jake, I'm gonna go ahead and sleeve this cat up, printer proof, too. So, yeah, definitely gonna do that anyway. Nice, Jake. I've been trying to get him, like before all like the main breakers, the big the big dogs doing like the 10, 15 case, 20 case breaks, 5 case jumbo breaks and stuff like that. I was trying to get this cat, and he was going for a lot of money. His rookies, his rookie cards, I wanted to get a couple, and his rookie cards are really, they're kind of up there a little bit. Not everybody is, but he definitely is. Rainbow. For the Rangers. Rainbow for the Rangers. That's one blaster down. Not a bad one either. Wander and a freaking auto. Man. Parallel auto at that, not even a base. That's what's cool about it, you know? Like, both the top ones out of that out of that blaster were parallels. That's that's the cool part. That's what I'm talking about. Joe Ryan, printer proof. This is another cat, man. I've seen it. Like I said, I'm a tribe guy, so you know me. And a Strider base. I'm a tribe guy, so I've seen this cat pitch a few times this year. And I'm going to tell you what, I haven't seen Spencer Strider pitch at all. And I know I looked up his stats because I've seen, I was like, I've seen his cards were going for so much. And I was like, who the hell is this Spencer Strider guy? You know? And I, I looked him up and I was like, what? i seen his stats. I was like, man, I need to get on to this cat. You know what I mean? And uh, Joe's a little, Joe on a printer proof here is a little O.C. 
It's like, I need to get on to this guy, and man, I cannot for the life of me. I just can't pay that much for a, a pitcher's auto. Like, the ones I was looking at were like around 300 bucks. I was like, man, that's kind of steep for a rookie pitcher that I'm not even a fan of their team. You know what I mean? If he was an Indian, uh, <laughs> maybe. <laughs> Well, I can't say Indian. I'm sorry. Yeah, I don't want to do that. I can't do that. Andre Jackson. Printer proof for the Dodgers. Didn't we have one of those earlier? I think we did, right? I think so. Keep a lookout on the SPs. I miss one guy or so you know the inserts at the the little writing on the bottom isn't gold it's a different color if I miss it holler at me Kyle Moeller for the Braves Sonny Gray Cal Ripken and Luis 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 Robert Get that Moeller up I've opened a lot of products, the baseball product too, and I like Strider has like eluded me. He was very elusive. Duran, Ted Williams on the foil, Sterling Marte printer proof. I had this one already, right? Let's see if we pull another uh, another Wander foil as well. Why not, right? Everything else doubling up. I know I got these guys. Ted, gotta speed up Teddy here. Speed up Teddy. The socks. Try to get everything packed up today from the other, the other night. I got well, everything's ready to go. It's all you know, but I was waiting till after today, to get everybody's stuff out. For one time, modern artists for the Red Sox, Devers. These are not numbered. That's what I was talking about with the gold. It's gold is normal. And Burger. Judy. Oh, Welker, Max Scherzer, a Tatis foil, Molina, printer proof, and Joey Votto. Add there. Cardinals lost yesterday, right? Yeah, they did. I watched like the last ninth, like the the end of that. Not like the ninth inning. Well, I had it on as background. I was kind of, I was working, and I had it on, so I was watching, but I wasn't watching. And I seen a, I think the pitcher was like in the ninth inning, and I remember who was pitching, but Boom was up with two guys on with two outs, and the pitcher hit him. I mean, how are you gonna in a playoff game? He hit him to load the bases. And who was next up? Uh, Gene Segura was the next one up. And he got a base hit and scored two runs. Joe Ryan. Sterling Marte. Seth Beer. And Mookie Betts. Blaster number three.
toss that over there, buddy. Leo Ramos, Cody B, Clayton Kershaw foil, Jose Siri, he hit a, that was the only run that uh, Tampa uh, had the other day, yesterday, against the Tribe, was this guy solo homered. Play center field for them, and like, no offense to Mr. Siri, but he kind of looked like He was out of shape a little bit. He got kind of a gut on him. Or for a center fielder, you know, usually you see them fit center fielders, usually they're kind of trim. You know what I mean? <laughs> kind of looked like he had a little gut on him. Center poop with Siri. This kind of caught me off guard, you know? I was like, damn, I was like, he had kind of a little bit bigger gut than I do. I had to play center field once in softball, though. A lot of people didn't show up that night, you know what I mean? I had a, well, kind of like all the other guys, I don't play outfield that much anymore. I usually would play second base and catch, you know, and play some first, stuff like that, you know, and guys didn't show up, and the other guys were like, who's playing center? Oh, well, I'll do it. <laughs> I didn't make a joke. I didn't make a butt out of myself, so that was good, you know what I mean? I did, I did what was needed. But there was some guy, a guy in left field. You want to have a strong left fielder was stronger than me. So he was kind of like, he was really good and he was helping me out. So that was good. Hunter Green. I think I pulled, how many did I pull out of these out of that first break? These Hunter Greens. Man, I pulled a lot, right? I, I pulled like two printer proofs. And like Three bases, something like it was. It was crazy. Like right out the gate, too. Like hundred green, hundred green, hundred green. Matt Brash, Gavin Sheets, foil. Look at that one. The White Sox, nice one. Really nice on that foil. Juan Soto, printer proof for Washington. Another one. Nice. And oh, look at that. The O'Neill Cruz right after that. Wow. Then a Randy. Man, whoo! Seems like when you get a pack, you get a pack, right? Man, bro, I'd say these blasters have been pretty decent. Come on, come on, Gavin. There you go, buddy. There you go, buddy. There you go. It's OC, but the corners look good. The surface looks good. Gavin, getting a nice little foil collection over there. I mean, of some nice hits. Been lucky on those. Juan Soto as well. Printer proof. Guys, is the checklist out yet? For, uh... Stadium Club and updates supposed to be coming. I'm really wanting to, the Stadium Club checklist. I I probably I kind of you can kind of get guess that right. You know you can kind of figure that out. Not the Stadium Club, the update checklist. Yeah, you can kind of figure the Stadium Club checklist is really what I'm wondering about because that should have been out like what back in June, right? So I'm concerned whether I'm concerned because I like Stadium Club. So I'm concerned whether or not that that's gonna carry the updated checklist like gallery has because we can't go back to the series one checklist we just we can't do it cabrera otto lopez chris bryant two rookies two veterans i can't do it well i guess i can oh well, there's still some good stuff in there but i like having these new guys in there even though we're, yeah, we really been, other than Hunter Green, we really haven't been pulling too many of the new guys yet. Kyle Moeller, Francisco Lindor, printer proof for the Mets. 
Miss Gill, and uh, Wilson Contreras for the Cubbies. More packs out of the third blaster. Jared Duran. Printer Proof, Ryan Sandberg. Cal Rally, and a Josh Bell. We'll go ahead and sleeve up Cal here. This stuff, big catch fire. I think it was going good before he hit that home run the other day. Because his autos were already popping pretty good. He did hit about, what, 20-something home runs on the year. Sandberg with the printer proof for the Cubbies. Tyler O'Neill stuff in the first break too, didn't we? Some parallels. Here we go. We got a foil, a last foil of the third blaster, and it's Josiah Gray, Brian Hayes, and Tyler O'Neill base. So the Nationals, the Soto printer proof, and a Josiah Gray rookie foil. Yeah. Everything looks good on it, except for it is a little OC. Surface is good. Corners look good. I like those foils, though. They're nice. Alright, first monster up. I think our autos last time, I think it was like the last, the last one we had all the way at the bottom, right? The first ones, well, or, or on this side, somewhere in the middle, so we'll see. We'll see if that trend keeps going that way. Brian De La Cruz, Eloy Jimenez, Chaz McCormick, Garrett Cole, and Andre Jackson. Gavin Sheets. Jose Abreu. We got a yellow coming to insert. Modern artist Aaron Judge. And these inserts are pretty nice too. Molina. And a Reed Detmer's rookie. Judge. I see that yellow, right? And it reminds me of, in New York, right? It reminds me of taxis. Even though the last time I was in New York, I didn't see that many damn taxis. Maybe it's the time of the day it was. I don't know. I don't know because I was there for like three days. Maybe everybody's Ubering. That's what it is. There's no. There's no cabbies anymore. There's no cab cars anymore. They're all Ubers. Nice card. Dang, nice looking card. Matt Manning. Steven Stroudsburg. We've got a foil coming up. Pittsburgh Pirates. Brian Reynolds. 
Javi Baez, and Vidal Brujan. Vidal Brujan. My memory is correct. That auto was coming up. I tore that one all jacked up, didn't I? Just be careful here. Gotta be careful. There we go. Nick Lodoto. Mike Drzemski. And there's our first auto. I said it was coming up, right? These things are so predictable. That's why you. Never buy loose packs. Except if you're me, and then you go buy the hobby store and you buy a $35 jumbo pack. Hey, I got to wander out of it, though. So, a rookie? Numbered? No, it is not. I didn't think it was because the uh, border on it. For the Mets. Tyler or Tyler McGill? Looks nice too, boy. Minty. I think you see a little piece of... But that's like on the outer edge. That's like on a circle. You might just go like that and just bring it right off. Everything else on it looks pretty good. So the Mets got the first auto. I like a rookie auto. I like to get somebody with a bat in their hand for the next person. But I like rookie autos. And that's our second auto because we got one out of the blasters. So that's our second auto. We just need to get the guy with the bat in his hand, like I said. Brandon Woodruff. Boom! Tell Marte. Matt Olson. And Bo Bichette. Now we've pretty much seen, I think all these rookies, are, I don't think they're adding anybody who isn't in this to uh, to Topps update. I think the rookies we see here is who they're riding out the rest of the year with. With that being said, uh, what do you guys think? I mean, compared to last year, I, people, I, I love last year's rookie. I didn't love it, but I really, really, really liked last year's rookie class. There were some... Now I think about it even more. I really do like it even more. Andrew Vaughn, uh, Dylan Carlson, Jazz, Mount Castle. Um, man, the, the pitchers, too, that were out. I mean, it, the list goes on. Tristan, Mookie Betts, the Dodgers, uh, the Portrait Gallery. Yep. Frank Thomas and Freddie Freeman in his Dodger gear. Finally. I've seen him in Brave stuff. All year long. Even though he might prefer to be still in his Braves gear. That's a whole nother story. Nice look for Mookie Betts there. I think that looks pretty centered up. Casey Mize. Roger, Roger Dodger, Roger Dodger, Andrew Vaughn, Robin Yount, Byron Buxton. Chipper. Jackson Coar. Edward Cabrera with the private issue. So this one will be numbered. You got Nolan on the base and Stan the Man. So for the Marlins, uh, where it's got a little. Nah, if you look at it like that, it's alright. Like I said, folks, I'm extremely, 
Three my piggy. What's the number on this thing? Number 77 out of 250. Other than that auto we pulled out of the blaster, I think that's our first numbered card. We pulled a decent amount of numbered cards out of our first break we did, but this is our first one other than the one auto. This is a pretty good one, so. Anytime you get a rookie number, even though this is like a retail only, it's still, it's still good. I figured you'd get more, though. Well, the other night we did. It ain't over yet. O'Neal Cruz foil. Hot dog. We got Roberto Clemente and a Juan Yepes. Clemente over there. Nice. The O'Neal Cruz spot. Oh, the Pirates in general. Did the Pirates, who got the autos? The Mets did, but who was the other one? Out oh, of the blaster. And that was Kansas City. Kansas City guy. Top loader over here. Little OC, but everything else on it looked really nice. You're good with that one. Go ahead and sleeve up this Dylan. Wander base. Got a spoil earlier. Looking good. Oh, the corner. You can see it. Top. Marcus Simeon. Andrew Benintendi. And the foil. Louis Gill. And Wilson Contreras. Benintendi on the foil. With all these orders, guys, I'm going to put in a pack for you guys. Um, every single one of them, I'll include one pack. Will you have a damage card or not? That way, in case uh, you want to like send any of these things in the tops or whatever, you can, you can do that. Or in case maybe you pulled any, ripped any on your own, and you didn't keep any. You didn't keep one. See that little, little corner right there. You did get the full earlier, and that one looked good. Theory. Insert coming up. It's the second one of this cat, right? Devers and the Modern Artist. Then we got it earlier. The base. Cal Rally. Josh Bell. I'm going to sleeve up and top load old Cal here just because he does have a good amount of pub around him right now. That auto is going to be the last pack, last one or two packs. TJ Fredell, foil coming up. Jose Barrios, Tyler O'Neill, Brian Hayes, and the foil is Twins, Sonny Gray. Maybe a Joe Ryan. Who's the other cat? Royce, Royce Lewis. Is Royce Lewis? I don't remember on the checklist if Royce Lewis had autos in gallery. I'm sure he probably does. He does in Chrome. He's auto only. And his is going pretty good money, too. Looked at picking a couple of his, one of, at least one of his up, because I don't have any. I don't think I even have any prospect ones of his. A lot of guys I get are, you know, prospects, too. 
generally the prospect autos you can get a, usually because of prospects for like three years, two, three years before they go pro. So Bobby Witt with the base. Logan Webb. We got a Tops Gallery. Master Strokes. Show A. Behind that we got Alex Manoa and Ted Williams. Show A Master Strokes. I think these Master Strokes are like one out of like 18 packs. So that's like one, possibly two of this insert and a monster. Or you're looking at one for every one or two for every three blasters for this insert set. So I think it's what seven packs and a blaster? Something like that. So you're not even guaranteed out of two blasters to get one. So it'd be like one out of every three, I guess. I think all their inserts are like one for eighteen or they're one for fifteen. I think the next wave might be the one for fifteen. First wit. Oh, that's on the uh top over in the state. Don't worry about that. I'm not taking it back out though. You're good on that. There's not a dot there. The lad. Trout. And a George Bet. I think that's the first. Out of this whole break, I think that's the first single pack. Had to be another one. Yeah, there had to be during a blaster. At least. We're, we got like no type of parallel, no insert or anything. Next wave coming up in here. And that's going to be a rookie, Shane Boz. Carlos Correa. And this twin, it's unique. Shane Boz. That's one of these next waves. I like these. That was the, uh, I think, the width that I pulled, right? Was this one? I remember it was a lot of blue. Boss hurt. No. Clutchin. Nolan Ryan. Pete Alonzo. And our foil is of a cubby. Afonso Rivas. Afonso. Rookie card. Rookie foil. Nice. Love rookie parallels, guys. Love them. They're not giving them away. You know what I mean? They're actually pretty tough to get sometimes. On this Wagner. Bo, we got something. We got color coming up here, guys. We got blue. And it's a lot of blue. Finally. Is it going to be the auto? It's St. Louis. Lars Newbar. And that thing looks nice, brother. Congrats, congrats. Look at that. Wow. Beautiful freaking card, man. 45 out of 50. Lars Newbar. Man, nice freaking hit. St. Louis was popping the other night too with uh who was it? Tyler O'Neill, right? My top loaders. That was a little piece of plastic in that one. I don't, I don't like using the top loaders. Like if you see at the entrance, there's like a little piece of plastic or something like that. I just throw those aside. I don't like even messing with trying to. These these cards are so sensitive. You can. Try to push it, and then, nah, I don't even do that. I just throw the top over to the side. I'll just cut that out. Man, nice freak. I like these. Wow, I don't know what the name of it is. I haven't checked on the box with that, that type of blue like that on there, but, man, that's a beautiful car. I'm going to have to hunt these down on, on the bay. I think the odds of pulling another one aren't really good. 
What's the odds on this thing? The blue is 1 out of 1,074. Is that right? No, up here it says the blue pattern. Okay, that's up here right there at the top. 1 out of 266 packs. So nice hit on the St. Louis. Wow, I'm jelly. I'm jealous, man. Wow. Fifty. I'd say that's a boom. Tyler Gilbert, Jaron Duran on the foil for the Red Sox. Tristan and David Ortiz. Jaron Duran coming back on a rookie parallel. Nice one. Talk about how much speed this guy's got, but I don't know his stats. I really didn't keep up with him too much, but I know whenever the, the tribe played him, they always would talk about this guy's supposed to be like super fast. I don't know. I don't know if he stayed healthy or what he did, but I know that Red Sox team, that's, that batting lineup, they got a lot of money. They got a lot of people on there, and their record shouldn't be what it is, but maybe their pitching isn't in order. I know Chris Sale they lost earlier in the year, Connor Wong. Herringer, Hoy Park, and Justin Verlander. This has got to be the second the second auto out of this monster. His third auto out of the break. Ramsey Contreras. Don't worry, that's not the auto. They don't have him last. Well, I say that. It's a blue auto, too. So another auto parallel. Let's see if we can get somebody with a stick in their hand. Alex Bergman. No, it's not. We got a parallel and an auto, okay? Let's see who's the parallel, who's the blue. It's Max Scherzer on the blue parallel. And the auto is going to be sideways. I'm thinking, oh boy, who is it? It's a pitcher. It's a pirate. It is Contreras. See, I was wrong. It didn't, didn't even say, oh, it said RA. I should have seen that. Sorry, guys. You caught that and I didn't. I thought it was going to be in this spot where the Scherzer was at. So Contreras. Not a bad auto. So Pittsburgh spot doing well. Get some top loaders over this way. O'Neill Cruz base, O'Neill Cruz foil. Contreras auto. Not bad, not bad. Congrats, congrats. Looks good too, brother. Hmm. Oh, pitchers though today. On the autos so far. We did get another number card. It came through. We ended up pulling three numbered parallels out of this box, which is cool. And the big rook. And got the uh the Marlins pitcher too. Cabrera on a private issue. Fifty out of seventy five for the Max Scherzer spot. The Mets are doing okay. They got an auto too, right? Yeah, they did. Oh, McGill. I'm sure. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that name right or not. This sucker's mint too. That's centered up real nice. And the blue, I think. We've seen the uh, blue pattern was 1 out of 266. Right? So that one, I think, was like 1 out of like 160 something. For the regular right blue, pulling some numbered stuff here, man. I like it, I like it a lot. Let's get somebody with a stick. Well, the new bar, yeah. You get the new bar. That was a hell of a card, number to 50. Ooh. It's Mr. McGill right there. His name is Tyler McGill, and he's but I had a song come to my head. I was like, nah, I better not do it. McCutcheon and another Strider. Hold you up on some Striders if we can't pull you a parallel. 
Load you up on some bases. Looks nice too. Looks real nice. See about halfway down on this side on this stack, right guys? Be an auto and all the way at the bottom on the next. I like it like that though. I like it like that. It lets me know when it's coming up a little bit so I can kinda like prepare for it. Don't just go right there and there it is, but I did almost do that last time. Kind of did. Juan Yepes foil for the Cardinals. Man. St. Louis. Y'all just got to win the game today. <laughs> it's the Phillies. I got to get it down, man. Yeah. Kevin, I don't think that is either. I mean, those are, I'm not, see, I haven't watched too many Pirates games, but I don't really look at their stat lines too much and stuff like that. I did. I do a little bit to kind of creep in. I like to see how Brian Hayes is holding up his second year, and I know he's had a lot of issues this year, and they, they moved him to third, right, and they got Cruz at foot short. I don't know too much about that cat, but uh, looked like he had, I glance, did glance at his stats a little while ago. It looked like they were pretty good. Jared Duran, modern artist. It's not a parallel because it's gold. So I'll flip it over. Ashby, Aaron Ashby for the Brewers. He's got some steam too. He does got a little bit of steam, so I'll go ahead and sleeve him up. I tried to pick up one of his autos as well, and I was unsuccessful in my attempts. Del Marte, Colton Welker, Corbin Burns with the foil, Brandon Marsh rookie. They're sitting him out. I was wondering how he was doing too. I looked at the last night. I was when I was looking at the box scores because I only watched. I watched all the Indians game, and that thing was fast. It moved. It was started like a few minutes after 12, and it was over by 12, by 228 when I looked at my, uh, I had it on the second monitor over here, and it was over by 228. And I had to run, do some errands, and, you know, actually get some stuff done. And by the time that evening, late that night, late last night, I, I sat down, I looked at all the box scores and stuff like that. Well, I had the, the end of the Cardinals and Phillies game on. I wanted to see who won the later games, what the box scores looked like, and stuff like that. And yeah, I'll just let's say I noticed that Brandon Marsh appears that they're not starting him, playing him at all against lefty pitching. So I looked at the stats. I was like, "Is he even playing?" Joe Ryan. We got auto. Here's our auto coming up. Shane Boz. Oh, it's a Sox. Who's it gonna be? Rami Gonzalez. A base, not numbered. But it's a position player, so okay, we're opening that door. This box. We got another auto coming out of here. Maybe we can get another position player out of this one. So, congrats to the White Sox. Like, I watched a lot of chrome breaks. I was in a lot of chrome breaks. And this guy's auto was, like, very, like, not easy to pull. It's a little bit of Right up there, but it's on top of the card, so he might just go like off. The rest of it looks really good. Centering don't look too bad. Top to bottom. Sterling Marte. Jake McCarthy. Duran, Johan Duran, that is. Brandon Crawford and Jonathan India. Indians got it fell off too, man. Remember when he won Wookiee of the Year last year? His card spiked, man. I got a nice one of his too. 
how to update. It's like the color match that red. It's red like a speckled. What is it? They called it. Right now I can't remember. It's a really nice car. I got a grade and I got a pen on it too. It was numbered like one and ninety nine or one ninety nine or one something like that. But his cars have fallen, boy. They have dropped severely. Julio finally makes an appearance today. And that sucker looks good. First glance. I believe Wednesday night we got two. One had corner issue and the other one I thought was gem mint. This one might be another gem Julio, brother. Bryce Harper on the insert. The master. Not the master, but the uh, gallery. The profile galleries, I think is what they call it. Portrait gallery, I'd say. Portrait. My bad. We might have got you another Gem Man Julio right here, brother. That's not the uh, shorty. The shorty looks like more cartoonish. For those of you who don't know, there are certain short prints in these, and they look like more of like a painting, like a more of like a artist type, arty type thing. The colors on them pop a little bit more, and you can really tell. Nice, nice rookie there. Let's see about this Bryce Harper. Hell of a comeback by the Phillies, boy. Hell of a comeback by them. Can't believe that pitcher hit Bohm. Bohm's a big dude. I understand that, but he came way inside on him. It was like high and inside, too. Like shoulder. It was like shoulder high and inside. It, that ball rode in on him hard. Pitcher gave it up. <laughs> Jesse Wink, Ryan Sandberg, and the foil is Houston Astros, Alex Breg Bregden, Bregman. Nice. I think we got a Jose Siri earlier, didn't we? It's like a printer proof or a foil, something like that. Astros. I think so. Al Tuck, Batiste, Shane McClanahan, private issue. That one will be numbered. The first numbered one right out of this box. Wow, it kind of like runs together, bro. Let's see, I'll put the sleeve on and I'll flip it over and show you what number it is. I always like to see what number I get. Number four out of 250. The other night, I think it was, uh, was it the pull holes? We got number one out of 125. Shane McClanahan. Four out of 250. Campanella. Anthony Rizzo. Griff. And the foil is St. Louis, Oz Smith. What they used to call him, called Ozzy Smith, they had a nickname for him. What was his nickname? Anybody know? Kevin, you know what his nickname was? I can't remember what it is. It's going to bug me because I, you know, I grew up in that age where you had the uh, TBS, you're watching Braves games, you're watching Cubs games, so I've seen a lot of... Cubs games, they was playing St. Louis like a lot back then, right? Because they're you know, rivals, same division and stuff like that. And I don't remember what they called him. What his nickname was. It's going to bug me now. I'm going to have to Google it. I remember he would do like backflips on the field at shortstop, stuff like that. Even Quan! The Wizard, right? Yeah, I think it was. Anthony Rizzo with the green. For the Yankees. And we got our autos next. That came early. Wow. Even Quan with the base. All his little all his cards in this right here. That little it's not it's not bad, but it's not perfect either. P 
Piazza. Here's the auto. It's going to be Arizona Diamondbacks, Tyler Gilbert. Another pitcher. Rizzo is numbered 67 out of 125. The Riz. Looks good, too. Top to bottom, left to right. Corners on this one look good. Nice one for the Yanks. One looks good too. Corners look sharp. It's a little OC, but not not bad. Not not to where it's ugly though. It's a nice looking card. However, it is a base, not numbered. Yeah, that's the fourth. That's our fifth auto because we got one out of the blasters. We got one more blaster left. Maybe we can pull another one out of another blaster. Bonus. Naquani. Still get another parallel out of this, I'm thinking. I don't know. Seems weird because that parallel, that even makes you more incentive not to go and get any loose packs of this. They're going to put a parallel in the same pack as the auto. And they're, well, that one was in a different spot, so. Shoei, Modern Artist, The Lad, Joey Bart, and Cal. Have not pulled a parallel insert yet. I was, the other day we didn't pull one. I don't think so. Wait. Hmm. Jazz. Hoskins. Luis. Bench. And Story. Burger right here coming up. Acuna. Jackie. Master Strokes. That's gold, so that's not going to be one either. Ricky and a Burger Rook. Bad looking burger either. And it seems like those Quans. It's really bugging me because it's like. And it's not a last in the pack thing. That's what I was thinking too. I was like, maybe it's a last in the pack thing, but no, it's n nobody else. It's not happening to anybody else. Go ahead and top load this one up just because I did all the master strokes. They are one out of 18 packs. The beer. Marcus Stroman. Derek Jeter. We got a foil. Seth Beer Rook. Joey Vato. We got, was it a Clemente? Yep. Berto Clemente on the foil for the Pirates. Pirates doing all right tonight, man. Pirates are doing all right. Not bad. Nice looking card on the foil, too. And a little flow, baby, a little flow. Next wave. That's a hunter green. Mookie and Alex Kirloff. And that's the gold, so it's not parallel. I don't think it's easy. Yeah, we did pull one. We pulled the, the pool holes that we pulled was a master master strokes. Right?
Mountcastle, uh, Machado, Foyle, Ian Anderson, Greg Maddox, Braves back to back. Let's see if we get a KC. Bo. Like, give me a wit. Give me a wit foil. Please give me a wit foil. Bo knows. Bo knows baseball. Bo knows football. Bo didn't know basketball though, did he? Or did he was he like a high school all American? Probably. Leo Ramos, Cody B, Ty Cobb, the Beebs, and McGuire. He did finally get me a Bieber auto like last week. Never got one. I was always putting it off. I mean, let me get one. This cat's going to go in the playoffs. Hunter Green, again. I pull a lot of Hunter Green, man. JD Martinez. Matt Brash, Bogert, and Puckett. Let's top of him. Why not? This is his only rookie card. It's just in fire, right? He is, he is in fire, I'm guessing. Besides the Series 2 short print. What are those keeping? What kind of like uh, value are those keeping right now, anyway? This traditionally was an auto. The other, the other boxes we did. Not in this one. Not unless they give us an extra, a freebie. Roy Seeger. Edward Cabrera. Ooh, that's an that's a parallel right there, brother. Joe Ryan. I envy you. This is gonna be nice. That's blue. Got a lot of blue today, Pena and Rendon. What's the blue number two? Ninety-nine. 32 out of 99. So we did get another number. I'm pulling some blue. That's a nice one. Well, I like these next waves. I'm going to see what these are going for. Wouldn't mind having this one. I'll tell you that. That's a nice pull, brother. The blue next wave on that all that blue water. Beautiful card. I like it. I like it a lot. 32 out of 99. I'm gonna sleeve up this Pena too, just because this cat he's a hell of a ball player, man. Hell of a ball player. All right, we got a bonus. We're gonna do that fourth box, that fourth blaster. Let's do it. Let's try to get that one more. Let's get somebody with a stick. Got two more monsters left. Alright, um, the break is up, and that might be the last one of this stuff, and if I can't get any more monsters, I won't do any more. Um, I want to pull that big auto for y'all, man. Nick Lodoto, Babe Ruth Foil, Juan Soto, and Ryan Sandberg. Nick Lodoto, too. I had one earlier. I didn't. I don't think I sleeved it. I think I kind of stuck into the pile. But let's get him sleeved up because this cat's Cincinnati. Why are they so bad? I mean, I did. They really did offensively. They did have Tyler Stevenson was hurt like all year long, so I I get that. You know, Indy was hurt early on. He came back on late, and then it took him a while to get into form. I'm not sure what was up with Votto. I'm surprised, to be honest with you, that they didn't move Votto. But I know he's kind of like a staple there. And after everybody else, they moved in the offseason. Who did they even get? Or Suarez and Winker and... Who's the guy they sent, sent to Toronto? Was it Berrios? We got another next wave blue out of this. We got another numbered card. Chaz McCormick Primer Proof for the Strohs. So that's a nice one. See who the it's a rookie. It's Seattle. Oh boy, look at that. 
Look at that bonus box. Man, that's a gorgeous freaking card. Boom! Look at that one. Dude, that is fire. A next wave blue color match. What was, his, what was his number? The 99, the other one, that Joe Ryan? I was loving the Joe Ryan. Man! Number on that is 49 out of 99. And it looks minty, brother. Hot dog! Wow! Don't let it go. Whoever whoever owns this card, don't let it go. I wouldn't. <laughs> I keep this one. That is sucker. I'd get it graded too, man. That sucker's nice. I put it I'd slab it up, brother. Man. Wow. Well we pulled a banger, right? Right, Kevin? We got a banger. Now where's his auto? Got two monsters left. We've been pulling a lot of blue today, right? A lot of blue coming out of this stuff, man. Which ain't bad. I mean, I'll take that over no colors. I'll take that. I mean, number to 99, ain't nothing wrong with that. Especially when it's a color match. You know, I almost rather take a color match that's a little bit higher of a number than a low number that's not a color match. That's got to be the hit of this blaster. It's got to be. Bob Gibson, Walker Bueller, and a Griff. Man. The fact that it was a blue, too, is why I'm really loving it. Because I love color. I'm all about color matches. Now, if you guys have been watching my channel for a while now, I mean, you know, I love my color matches. Shoei, modern artist, and a Perver Proof, Trey Turner. Shoei has been quiet. Well, got a couple of his bases. I think we got we did get the master strokes. Yeah, we did. We got his master strokes earlier. I think each one of those inserts, I think that one is one out of that they both might be one out of eighteen. They might be. I don't know. I can't remember if that one is or not. Trey Turner. Printer proof. Three packs left. Can we get another auto? Come on. Let's make it six autos. Even Quan, I'm just check out the corner on this one, guys. Let's let's hope the corner's straight for you, man. Let's look at it first. It's good. It's not too bad centered either. It's a little bit off, but it's not bad. It's probably the best looking Stephen Quan one I've seen. Piazza. Printer Proof, Garrett Cole, and who's the foil? It's sideways. Is it a trout? It is. The Mike Trout foil. Got you a, um, what is that? Reed Detmer's foil right out the gate earlier in the break. Guys, I haven't really been, I'm kind of like in and out on looking for the uh, short print difference. I figured they would stick out like a sore thumb though because... Of the color variation and stuff like that. How they're cartoony. Like a portrait. Kind of like a painting, right? Nice trout foil. Every Mike Trout's a good Mike Trout card, right? Especially when they're uh, looking like that. Where that one was centered up looking real good. I get all my trout parallels. Even uh, any trout parallels I get that I think that are Gen Mint 10. I try to. Maybe not all of them, maybe, but the majority of them I try to, I, I'll, I'll, I'll get them graded. Because it's a collect, it's collecting. <laughs> That's what we do. But I don't pull, well, no, I pulled that whammy. I love that whammy, but I got it up for sale too, but I, I, probably, I did price it up a little bit because it's like one of those things that's like, I don't want to get rid of it. But if someone pays that price for it, I will. Because <laughs> it is a 10. 
Hey, Stephen Kwan. He didn't have the best game yesterday. He was a little bit... I find it... They kind of got him popping up a little bit. We got a torque. Got him popping up a little bit. He was kind of getting under it. Andrew Vaughn. But that picture yesterday they had on. Who was it? I can't remember. Spencer Torkelson. Boost! And that corner's right there on the top. It's flipped. Maybe it's just the way the factory kind of throws some of these in. And that one, too, on that side. Both sides. It's flipped up a little bit, too, right there. But the rest of it looks pretty good. Huh. Not pull it up. It's still a torque. He's probably one of the more disappointing rookies' performances. They brought him back up. I don't. I haven't seen how well he's done since they brought him back up. Towards the end of the year here. But his average was pretty ugly for a while there. Wasn't keeping pace with the rest of his squad, I tell you that. Well, the rest of the Detroit Tigers he was keeping pace with. But Javi Baez turned it around because he wasn't doing that great either at the gate. But Jackson Coar. Andrew Benatendi. Oh, printer proof. Rami Gonzalez, second one for Rami. And our last foil is St. Louis. Albert Pujols. And that's, hmm, I was going to say looks good, but it doesn't really. Right there at the top, the center. And that corner's a little bit glitched right there as well. A little bit, not too bad on that one, but. Top spot. The centering is freaking beautiful, though. On the surface, it looked good. Again, I'll put packs. Everybody, one pack in everybody's order. One wrapper. All right, let's do a quickie. Uh, well, I gotta sleeve up this uh, White Sox guy over right here. Is Rami? Pretty good recap, I think, man. All right, first up, let's do the printer proofs first. Why not, right? Rami Gonzalez, who we just saw. Garrett Cole for the Yankees. Trey Turner for the Dodgers. None of these are numbered, folks. Uh, Chaz McCormick for the Strohs. Ryan Sandberg for the Cubs. Francisco Lindor for the Mets. Juan Soto for the Nationals. Jose Siri for the Astros. Yadier Molina for the Cardinals. Sterling Marte for the Mets. Andre Jackson for the Dodgers. Joe Ryan for Minnesota. Jake McCarthy for the Diamondbacks. Andre Jackson again for the Dodgers. And another Sterling Marte for the Mets. A couple double ups there, huh? All those. We're going to go on to the foils. All right. Albert Pujols. The Cardinals, Mike Trout, foil for the Angels, Babe Ruth for the Yankees, Bo Jackson for the Royals, Clemente for the Pirates, The Wiz for the Cardinals, Alex Bregman, uh, Bregman for the Strohs, Corbin Burns for the Brewers, Juan Yepes for the Cardinals, the rookie foil, nice one there, Andrew McCutcheon, Jared Duran, again rookie foil for the Sox. Revis, another rookie one. Sonny Gray for the Twins. Benintendi for the Kansas City. O'Neill Cruz foil for the Pirates. Patel Marte for the Diamondbacks. Brian Reynolds for the Pirates. Josiah Gray for the Nationals. Gavin Sheets for the White Sox. Clayton Kershaw for the Dodgers. Tatiste for Padres. Ted Williams for Boston. Uh, this guy, I didn't top load. I'll get him top loaded. Marcus Simeon for the Rangers, Reed Detmers for the Angels, and a Wander Franco foil. Looking minty, boy. 
GM10, Wander, Wander Franco foil. And that was the first card that we, I think we, the first pack we opened, right, was that Wander foil. Believe so. There's your foils. Some notable rookies here. Regular base ones uh, put aside. Torkelson. Stephen Kwan, the best looking one I've seen out of this, come out of this product. A lot of his do have them corner areas. Hunter Green. Julio Rodriguez. And that one looking minty as well. Julio spot coming through today. Bobby Witt. With another base rookie out of him. I say another, but we got one the last break I did. Uh, I believe so, right? Or was it just a printer's proof? I know we got a printer's proof. Kyle Rowley. A Wander. Kyle Rowley. And an O'Neill Cruz. Nice, notable base rookies there. Some other ones. And some Master Strokes. Shoei, Mark McGuire, and a nice Aaron Judge modern artist. I like that modern, I like that Aaron Judge modern artist as well. Real nice. For the autos, we had Tyler Gilbert for the Diamondbacks, Ronnie Gonzalez for the White Sox, Ron Ronzi Contreras for the Pirates. Tyler McGill for the Mets. And a green. One number. We got one parallel auto. And this one came out of the first blaster that we did. John Hensley. A Heasley. Number 29 out of 99. The green. Numbered parallels. Banger. With the blue color match. The, man, I, man, lucky dog. Number 49 out of 99. Julio Rodriguez, um, Joe Ryan for the Twins, another nice blue next wave, wow. Anthony Rizzo, green. Shane McClanahan, private issue, the Rays. Max Scherzer for the Mets on the blue. And the regular blue is 75, so these ones are 75. And the other ones are 99. And this one I think was 99 too, right? The Lars New Bar rookie. <laughs> and this is the pattern. When well, they have have it, they had something on the checklist. I showed it earlier in the video. When I pulled this, and these are numbered to fifty. Okay, so you got the blue to ninety nine, the other blue to seventy five, right? And then this one to fifty. It's very confusing. Blue pattern. That's a nice looking card too. Wow, a couple really nice freaking rookies coming out of this. And Edward Cabrera. For the Marlins, number to 250. It's a private issue. So only two private issues out of this break. Some other like rookies I sleeved up. The Dodo, he got a couple, I think. Pena, Stephen Kwan, McCarthy there, Aaron Ashby, Spencer Strider, Yepes, Hunter Green, Strider again, Jeremy Pena. Some of the different ones I stuck aside right there. Um for sure. Shoei for the Modern Artist, Next Wave, Hunter Green, Vlad, Modern Artist, Bryce Harper, Portrait Gallery, Modern Artist, Bo, Next Wave, Shane Boz, Red Sox, Modern Artist, Mookie, Next Wave, is that Lou Bob, Luis Robert, yep, and then Red Sox, and then Acuna for the Braves. Alright guys, uh, that's it. Um, as of right now, I got my last bit of this stuff. It's going to be two monsters, same break as this, and that's how I, I, I put the photo up. It was going to be four blasters and two two monsters, all right? And I think that's going to be it of this stuff that I probably do because I can't find any more monsters that aren't, like, you know, being bought up and then try, people trying to scalp them or whatever. So, um, yeah, if I can get some, at a, even at, if, I can get them, if I can get them for, like, you know, 85 or even 90 maybe i'll go ahead and pick them up from somebody maybe somebody local i know guys that go around and you know then they sit on stuff and like they'll, they'll sell it to me for a couple bucks extra or, you know five bucks extra or whatever and i'll sell them stuff some guys i sell them to them for actual retail value 
and some other guys I'll be like, yeah, give me five, just give me five bucks, you know, give me five bucks, and they'll play like, give me five bucks or whatever. And we kind of or just trade back and forth with stuff like that. It's all about being a community. You meet people when you go out and you find these cards and stuff like that. Over the last couple of years, like when you stand in line, you're waiting for the restock or whatever, you know, and you just talk to other people, and a lot of people are pretty cool. You know, you can always find the jerks, you know what I mean, but. A lot of people in my area are pretty cool, thank goodness, you know. You get what you give, right, you know. You don't have to be a jerk to people and get along with people and kind of like form your little community or whatever. So that's a little tip for you guys. If you get out there, you see somebody in the store that's going to get in cars or something like that, just, you know, try to hook up with them. Maybe when they're out somewhere, like I got people who will be out they'll be out of the Target. They'll be out of another Walmart. Like, hey, bro, they'll take a picture. Do you want any of this? I'm like, yeah, give me three of those and give me two of those. You know, something like that. And I'll do the same thing for them. And we do it for other items, too, not just even cards. You know what I mean? I'll do it like as I collect a, I, I'm like an 80s kid, so I collect, like, Transformers. I do get Transformers in from my distributor. If you see them, they'll, I'll have them on my eBay all the time. So I do get new ones in all the time for that. But there's certain ones, sometimes I miss the order or my distributor doesn't ship them to me. They just cut me out of it altogether. So, you know, they'll, I'll be like, hey, if you see this one, get one for me. You know, something like that. But anyway, uh, like, share, subscribe, guys. Um, look for, I got a select football one going. I'm doing two next week. I'll do, uh, I think it's Wednesday night and Thursday night. I'll do the breaks. But the auctions end on Tuesday and Wednesday. Select football. I think that's going to be a fun one to do. Because it's like eight hanger packs. Those hanger packs are bangers. And it's going to be uh, eight select blasters as well. But I think you can get numbered cards out of the blasters. I don't think you can get them out of the hangers. I'm not sure. You might be able to. I don't know. I think you can get, yeah, I think you can. But uh, so look out for that and look out for this exact same break that's going to be ending on Wednesday night, I believe. And hopefully that won't be my last one because I'm having fun with doing this stuff. I like ripping it. And today was like beautiful cards out here today. I really like how that looks. So I hope you guys are very happy for you. So like, share, subscribe, guys. Bye for now. Off to the next. And go try. We got 30 minutes till noon. So. Woohoo! You know what I'm doing the rest of the day. Later. Well, I gotta get your guys' stuff together. I got 30 minutes to get your, get back your guys' stuff, and then I'm gonna watch the drive game. Alright, later.